All right, everyone, the time has come. The fan club edition of my Kotokumi Real Life Tour is here. It literally just came a second ago at the door, so let's open it. I cut the box open, so once again, disclaimer, you don't have to watch me open it. <laughs> so here we are. I'm so excited. Ooh, look how big it is. So this is just the regular Kotokumi fan club one, not the HMB or whatever, low B store thing. So yes, I knew this one had the Japanese cover. Let's check, is there anything else in this box? I don't believe so. All right, we'll throw that to the side for now. Wow, guys. Access all areas. Artist Kotokumi, Live Tour 2019, Relive. Or Relive, whatever. Kotokumi, Live Tour 2019. I'm really happy that this one had the Japanese cover because I just really like Japanese. So there you are from a distance so that you guys can see it better. All right, so here's our spine. We've got a photo book and the contents here. So let's see, what have we got? We've got the black cherry, then we've got audio commentary version, and then we've got Japanese, audio commentary of that one. And we've also got our bonus footage behind the scenes, Kotokumi 19th to 20th anniversary event, which I'm really excited about this. Um, and the music videos and MCs. So, awesome. Let's open this up, guys. I'm really excited about this. I don't know if like this version is just like Japanese photos for the photo book. And then the HMV Lopi one, if that's like, uh, the black cherry, so I, I have no idea. So, okay, yeah, I figured that was just a paper like it normally is. All right, so we've got our logos here, black cherry and Japanese. And this is our live documentary photo book. All right, let's open this up. Let's see what we have. La 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 la. Real live, relive. Okay, here we go. Oh, we do have some black cherry. Look at that, her in the fish tank. That is awesome. She looks amazing. I was so, guys, like I was freaking out when she was coming out of the tank. It was so cool to be able to see that live. There she is swimming. Very, very cool. Still looks amazing even though she was just swimming around in a bunch of water. Makeup looks flawless, of course. So cute, she's so happy. I really enjoyed the black cherry too. I'm really happy that there's black cherry photos in this. This makes me really happy. Also loved the ponytail. I was so happy to see her donning like this long hairstyle. Oh, that's a really pretty photo. I like that, like this black and white, or it could be a sepia tone. I can't really tell in this light. Beautiful shot, love those gladiator heels. Those gladiator heels like give me life. They're amazing. Oh, that's a good photo too. There we go, gladiator heels. Love them. I want some just like them. I have no idea what occasion I would wear them for, but that doesn't stop them from being awesome. Oh, okay, and this is the dress that she had on during candlelight and twinkle. And that was for Koi no Tsubomi and milk tea. Oh, we do get some Japanese too, so we get a mix of all of them. I wonder if they're both the same photo book or if they're different. It would make more sense if they were at least different from each other. I love this kimono. It is so beautiful. And I actually, I love her hairstyle with this. 
and they did such a great job for having a much smaller stage set than when she did this for the arena tour. This is a gorgeous photo. I love this. But like they, like the, doing all the stage stuff and like the accessories and like the bridge, like it was just phenomenal. Like I was so impressed. These are beautiful. I love all the shots with this kimono. Like these are so cool. They did a really good job with this photo book. Oh, and we get this outfit too. So this is when she did Pink Spider, Slow and Escalate. Oh, I loved this, guys, in the live. Oh, I got chills during this part and like I teared up. It was so beautiful and stunning. This is the Pink Spider performance when she was on top of the cage. And this is when she sang, I believe it was Koi Shikute. And in the air, I think she sang one other one. I can't remember what it was though right now. Oh, here's the Get Naked performance. When these, when all her dancers came out with those light sticks, lightsabers, whatever you want to call them, I was like, no, what is about to happen? And then I heard the new song Get Naked and I was freaking out. It was amazing. Oh, I love that. That's so cool. I am so excited to watch the Get Naked music video, like to see the whole thing. It's going to be awesome. This is the K performance. So cute. I was surprised that she didn't fall off those, the ball while she was doing that performance. I know I heard she did for a few of the performances, but I'm sure she did much better than I ever would have done. Oh, that's a cool shot. I like that. Her hanging on the aerial ribbon. That's really cool. And put your hands up. And the encore. Oh, yeah, then she dives off the end. Yep. That's awesome. I think they did a really cool job with that photo book. Like, I'm really happy that has a lot of photos in it. That is pretty awesome. I'm very well pleased with that. All right, guys, now let's look at the discs. So here's the back of it. And here's our beautiful cover. All right, let's open. Oh, this looks so cool. Oh my gosh, I love this setup. This is so cool. Okay, so over here we've got, it looks like the Black Cherry and the Japanese disc. Um, disc three DVD bonus footage. Over here, Black Cherry. Oh, the non-stop mix. I forgot about this. There's like a music CD. I totally spaced that. Okay. And this is the other Japanese mega mix. I don't know what those are or like what to expect with it. Like, is it just all of the songs live in this mashed up mix? I'm guessing. I don't, I don't have no idea, guys. But this looks so cool. Like, I love this whole TV thing here showing the old, or sorry, this is the new Japanese. And do they have any of the old ones? No, not on that one. And then this one shows the old, previous 2007 Black Cherry pictures. That is so cool. When you lift it up, does it still show more photos? Let's see. Let's see, guys. I'm curious. Oh, it does. Okay. <laughs> it still shows more of the photos. That's so cool. Let's look at all of them. Okay, there's that one. And let's look at this one. Yeah. So cool. Oh, I love this so much. They did a really cool job with this layout. I'm gonna have to put these CDs in to see what these are and what they even sound like and let you guys know. Is there anything in this? I don't think so. I think that's just the board itself. All right, so that's that. And I just saw this fall out. <laughs> I guess I have a, is this a sticker? I'm guessing this is a sticker. Um, or is it just cardboard? I don't know. No, it's a sticker. <laughs> it is a sticker. And I think this probably has the code. There's like a digital photo book or something that you can get. So yeah, guys, like this is pretty cool. Like I'm very pleased with this whole thing here. Like I think they did a really good job with the boxing 
and the photo book it is just beautiful and I'm really excited to see all these DVDs there's a lot of content in this so I feel like it was worth the amount spent and plus you still get both tours in one box so pretty good deal and oh I also need to show you guys my blu-ray editions so here is my black cherry blu-ray edition here so I mean there's nothing really special on the inside I'm kind of sad she's not doing like the photo books and just her regular DVDs like she used to, but she is doing these massive photo books and her fan club ones that I get, so I guess it's fine. So there's the Black Cherry Blu-ray, and then here is the Japanesque, and so same thing just in red, yeah, and nothing too exciting there either. But I really like these two covers. I I love the outfits for the new ones, so I was kind of disappointed that the new ones weren't on here. But at the same time, it's really cool to see her like wearing these outfits from so long ago and still looking as amazing as she did like that many years ago. Like she almost looks the same. And I just think that's so cool. And so I got those. And then they also came with these postcards since I had pre-ordered, so I got two of them. So I'm probably gonna give one of them to my friend. Um, who I just introduced to Kodakumi recently. So yeah, I just got these two little postcards. So yeah, guys, that is my unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed it. I was super excited to share this with you. Let me know what additions you guys got if you've gotten it, and I will be sure to keep you posted on all of the content and what I find out is actually in this box after I get through it and watch it. So thanks, guys. I will see you soon.